Welcome back, folks. It's me, it's me, it's Mysterious JG. We're gonna load a game where I have got Zach into this room again, this time with the uh, yellow crayon, and he's got the wallpaper map for what it's worth. Uh, I thought he had the wallpaper map anyway. Maybe he doesn't have the wallpaper map. He does have the wallpaper map. Alright, so I also uh, brought one of the goils here to see. Uh, the statue, although I think she was here the last video too. And give me an E. All right, let's go do an E. So as irritating as the mazes are in this game, at least we've got puzzles. Been watching uh, an LP of a game called uh, what the hell is it actually called? Five Days a Stranger, which I thought I was going to really enjoy at first, and it's been a fun LP. The LPers made it interesting, but um, and apparently the person who designed the game is kind of an internet person. But uh, it's sort of masquerading as like a puzzle game. It's really just kind of this guy wrote a story, and uh, he makes you click and walk through it. There's like one pu It's set over five days, and each day appears to have one, maybe two puzzles you got to solve. Mostly, it's a uh, expository text. It's a ne neat little story, but I don't know, man. They just don't make them like they used to. Hey, his handcuff has been removed. Excellent. Let's pick up the crystal here. And that makes the room go dark. Uh, I guess let's get out of here. I guess the crystal was supposed to be providing light. Okay, whatever. And, um... I'm gonna get her back to the, uh... the ship before I, uh, forget about her. Our little buddy never even left, so... Wait a second. Her buddy must be used. Yeah, I must have put her helmet on her. She would have died. So they both need to re to re up their oxygen. Yeah. Okay. For a minute, I thought maybe I just had her uh, put on her helmet, open the door, and let her friend suffocate. But no, I wasn't that stupid. Now what's nagging at me here is that I think there's something else I'm supposed to get in the the mar the the maze section of the face on Mars. Oh, come on. Screen exit is not obvious here at all. And on this screen, how the hell are you supposed to be able to tell you're supposed to walk to the right? Other than the fact that it's a wide open space over there. Alright, let's close the door and get ready for that irritating noise. Noises off. I took off my helmet. I took off my helmet. I am a gorilla. Uh, yeah, you can't take off the golden key. Yeah, okay, thank you, irritating sound effects. In order to make it, like, audible to you, it's like, you know, I don't want to say deafening, but it's pretty freaking loud for me. Oh, yeah, that's the stuff right there. Oh, yeah, okay, now back to Zack. Fighting crime in a future time. Back to cops. Okay, we gotta find a way out of here if it's the last thing we ever do. Oh, wait. Now, I think I remember how to turn the old uh, yellow MacGuffin back into the two yellow I've got the two crystal shards now the crystal shards are being filled a thousand girls a thousand thrills a million ways to power your magical device for stopping the aliens from turning us dumb no the uh, crystal shards I think I remember how to put them back together I remember where you do it, I remember some of the items involved, but I have a bad feeling that I'm missing one piece at the Grand Line. 
So I guess the since you know Zach's got plenty of money and we can always get him more, we have to go back to the spaceship at some point before this is over because I'm pretty sure that's how you get the Bermuda Triangle. So I'm not worried about wasting money flying Zach places he doesn't need to go, and I, for that reason, I'm all about. Wow, that took us like right back to the heart of the maze. That would have been a lucky door to stumble across earlier. But yeah, for that reason, I'm not all that terribly worried about uh, wasting money flying him places. So let's go try what I think it is we're supposed to do to get the yellow crystal back. And if I'm wrong, well, you know, so what? Big deal. Uh, da, 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 da. Come on, Zach. I wasn't really sure how to go about this, folks. I know you're not looking forward to watching the maze again, but uh, I also didn't want to just uh, not even show you how we got out of... Uh, not even show you how I got... Damn it! No progress at all. But yeah, it wouldn't be fair for me to just get out of the... Um, to get out of the maze and have the crystal and not show you how that happened. So I figured you'd want to see uh, us coloring in the thing with the yellow crayon and all the other exciting stuff that happened. Now I guess I'll save it for when we get to Peru, but uh, this LP, or this, this uh, you know, Central American theme that we're suddenly taking on of going around these ancient temples... It's a really good excuse to start singing of Serious Cities of Gold. Nope, nope. I'm going to save it. Save it for when it's uh, necessary. Because it's, it's, of course, desperately necessary later. And then I sing the Serious Cities of Gold theme. God damn it, Zach. Find your way out of here. I'm sick of this crap. You've got breadcrumbs. I remember, again, I'm pretty sure I remember at least the puzzle those were for. So, um... And it's not here, but no, you have to use them in something. And you can't just click the floor. So, trail of breadcrumbs would be... All that means is that we could find our way back to where we started, but... We've crossed our own path like eight times by now, I'm sure. Damn it, Zack. Leave this place. Oh. Yeah, another walking around in circles video. I'm sorry, folks. I will... I should have busted out the map. But I don't know why I didn't. Sheer, unadulterated laziness. But we can be pretty sure... Oh, Jesus Christ. I know when we get into rooms with only three doors that I'm getting closer to the center. Wait a minute, have we tried going this way from here? I mean, the issue here is that this isn't particularly fun. It's supposed to be fun. And in this game, I don't really know how you would go about making a map of the the, the maze. I give in Zork, you used to ugh, used to be able to drop um, items in a room, and then you'd know if it was a room you'd already been to when you came back. I guess you could do some kind of pattern with how you light the, the, the torches in each room, but... I mean, you know... It just doesn't seem that workable. Oh, please don't tell me I'm going to spend the whole video wandering back out of here. Come on... I'm really starting to wish that, uh... Oh, jeez. To wish I had some puzzles that I could work on Mars. So that I could just off-screen get Zack back out of here. But, uh...
come on, there's no chance this is going to be it. It's not going to be that simple. Just trying to keep trying doors that don't look like ones I've tried recently before. Kind of feel like for some reason at least one of the maze entrances is one of these doors that was on the far left of the screen. But if I just keep trying them, I'm just going to go around in circles. He does have a handsome stride, though. Look at that young man on the town. Zach McCracken. Little wheels in his head spitting, trying to figure out ways to win the love of the beautiful Annie. Because he hasn't met the two younger, hotter chicks from, uh, well, not from space, but from Yale yet. Yeah. Yes! Woohoo! Good God, finally. Don't have a whole lot of time to try, uh. Now, oh, shut up, birds. Oh, and while wandering around the uh, jungle last time, there was a, like, vague DOS animal noise, and then Zack said, Oh no, what was that? But I don't think there was any actual danger. Not like the uh, monster that thinks which will kill you, and which you never get to see, because that would involve, you know, fancy graphics that they weren't willing to do. <laughs> oh, good grief. Alright, let's read the cash card so I can see just how foolhardy I can be with money. Eh, that's plenty. Like I said, if I need to go back to, uh, I need to go back to Bermuda anyway, so. So let's try going to London, because that is some place that I know we need to mess with before, well, that I, bleh, we've already been there, I know, but remember how there was Stonehenge, and there was like a big, big stone slab that we had access to? I believe Stonehenge, and the mysterious... Mysterious Stonehenge. Nobody knows who they were or what they were doing. The druids. Um, amazing mystery of the ancient Mayans revealed. Oh, fuck you, game. Do, 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 do. You are still passed out. That was some powerful hooch, buddy. You must have some incredibly wet pants. Alright, but I remember for sure this was involved with putting the yellow crystal back together. So now we've got crystal shards. Crystal shards! Put that on the altar stone. Boom. Let's use another crystal shard on the altar stone. We put the flagpole on the, on the uh, altar stone. And... This is where I was worried that, uh, I don't know what else to do. Use the bobby pin sign? No, that doesn't work. No, oh, the toolkit's closed. I was, oh, because I was selling it to the, uh, the guy to get money for, um, Gentle Annie. And our nose glasses, oxygen tank, small We haven't used the guitar yet, have we? I don't know how. Guess he's got to give it to one of the girls later. Use the butter knife? Nope. Remote control, wallpaper map. Wallpaper map's not going to do anything here, I don't think. Nope. We've got to somehow get it to strike lightning. And I don't think we've got what we need to do that. Sadly, I do not believe this is happening right now. So, keep your eyes peeled as you play the game, folks, for things that would cause lightning to strike. There is no blaspheme Zeus button that we can select. We've got push, open, take off, switch. We do not have blaspheme Zeus. So, we're going to have to think of something else. Uh, but in the meantime... 
We are making progress. Uh, we'll never have to go through that maze in Mexico again. So uh, we're going to call it a video here. Uh, this has been Mysterious JG. I want to thank you very much for watching this amazing video. Hoo -hoo. And we'll see you next time, folks. Bye-bye.